Roni Odiambo is among 169 students from Agenga Secondary School in Nyatike, Migori County, who sat for the 2018 KCSE exams. When Education Cabinet Secretary Amina Mohamed released the results on Friday, Roni, who sent messages to the next short code, was shocked to be informed that there are no results. I'm very, very much disappointed. I don't know where to go, how to start and how to end. Anxiety and helplessness has gripped candidates from Agenga Secondary School after it emerged their results had been withheld. Parents and candidates say they're not aware of what might have gone wrong as they did not encounter any form of malpractice when the exams were being administered. Teachers from the schools bore the weight of anxious students and parents who made rentless calls trying to understand why the results had been withheld. Agenga principal John Raguero said they did not receive any explanation from NEC. We want to end the year knowing our results. Will we go to campus or not? We had invested a lot in group work. Our teachers did a lot, waking up for dons to teach us, and they had expected nothing but good results. It has been a very painful situation. Our teachers, our parents, we cannot even eat. You are making us even to contact some diseases which we are not supposed to contact at this age. And they analyze the previous years. How has the school done? It may be surprising to that person withholding it. In Kisi County, among the schools whose results have been withheld are Emesa AIC Secondary School in Bomachage Borabu and Monyanku High School in Gucha South. Little is known about the events that led to the withholding of results from the two schools as officials could not be reached. <laughs> In the meantime, Kenya National Examinations Council will finalize investigations into suspected malpractices and release a report on or before January 31st, 2019. Rosongoi NTV.